so you've seen my other log videos. And if you're trying to perform Harry's log, what's that? Maybe one day. I'll tell you the story about Harry, the guy at the coffee shop. Why did I remember his name? So anyways, um, if I have log base B of 9, and that's 2.197, and log base B of 7 is 1.946, then we want to evaluate these logs. Let's go. Boom. This is log base B. The log of the quotient is the difference of logs. So that's 9 minus log base B of 7. Then I can go and I can plug those in there. That's 2.197 uh -huh. minus 1.946. Finish him. I got a laptop in my back pocket. <laughs> Feeling like such a math god. This is 2.197 minus 1.946. Boom! That's 0. 0.251. I'm done. I'm done. And I'm on to the next one. <laughs> yeah! This guy! Ooh! The difference! Yeah, it's different. When you have the log of a quotient, that's a log base B of 1 minus log base B of 7. Then, whoa, whoa there. Yeah, um, what's the log of 1? Any of them. That's none. Boom! Special logs. I got a special log. See, the video on the special logs and then. That's a minus. Whoa. Wait for it. 1.946 is it. <laughs> Woo. Here. Boom. Ah! We have to break it up into its factors. That's log base B of 7 times 7 times 9 times. Yeah, all right. Don't believe me. Check it. It works out. Then, the log of a product is the sum of the logs. That's, whoa, log base B of 7 plus log base B of 7 plus log base B of 9. Fine. Why does he talk like that? <laughs> Some people say that I sound like him. Powerpuff Girls. Um, over there. Yeah. Uh, 1.9. Four six plus one point nine four six plus two point one nine seven. <sighs> Is anybody out there named Adam? Cause now what do we do, Adam? <laughs> yeah. Um. Um. Bam. 6.089 We're sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time. Harry's Law.